Hey guys, Nick with the Mic Loop. Here's a quick video tutorial showing you a few ways to best secure your mic when using the Mic Loop. Okay guys, so here's a few ways that you can secure your mic in the Mic Loop. Um, for one, this is the this isn't a traditional uniform shirt. This is actually my newly issued Elbico Body Shield Outer Carrier, and my Mic Loop is is coming out of the opening in the carrier just like it would on a uniform shirt if it were a zipper style or a button. But the most traditional way that a lot of people do is simply take the loop, open the clip on the mic with the clip pointed towards the cord, and all you do is hook the clip into the mic loop and let it ride. Obviously I've got a little bit of length here to show you a couple of different ways, but it would ride about right there if it were tightened down and secured down at the proper length. You can adjust the length however you need to by placement on the, the Velcro on the uh, body panels. Uh, the other recommended way that we do, that we suggest, is to actually take the loop and make like I'll do this, try to kind of do this slow so you can see the maneuver. But you take the loop and just make like a, a double loop, I guess. Put your clip in that double loop, tie it down. I like to go around the back of the clip and then cinch it tight. And that adds a little extra added security for like mic pull downs. If your mic gets pulled down, it doesn't it doesn't want to come off the loop and come unsecured. Um, lastly, then this is the most recent one that I've been experimenting with and I've seen a lot of guys do something very similar is where they actually take, take the mic, put it through the entire loop and allow it to sit secured this way. It's a great way, it's super strong. You don't run the risk of the clip breaking, which we've seen a lot of guys mic clip breaking. I like to take it one step further and I'll put my mic through the loop and then back around through it, making like a lasso effect around the cord. Um, one thing that's good about the the body shield outer carriers is they have this this little camera mic tab. It's it's pretty useless on its own, but for this purpose, I find that it really secures it down really hard. So I actually turn my mic around, my clip around on my mic. I'm gonna pull some slack out, put it onto my my little mic tab. I have a little earpiece, so I'm gonna go ahead and plug that in for aesthetics. Zip it up. And I mean, you'll see it sits very stably center chest. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit it as hard as I can, and it's not gonna come off. If in the event that the mic tab fails and it comes loose, it's still it's still attached to the mic loop, and I'm gonna have instant access to back up. My mic's not gonna fly fly off of me. If your shirt or outer carrier doesn't have a mic tab like this and you do have the opening like on a uniform shirt or perhaps if your outer carrier does have a, a zippered pocket here you can make that staple mounting point by using the opening of the shirt either a zipper style or a button style shirt to make that anchor point for your mic so the mic loop tethers it with the cord and clip on the inside of the shirt or pocket and it still has that that effect of that stable mounting point in the event it comes loose through a struggle or a fight or whatever you still have that tethered loop. If you'd like more information on ways to better secure your radio mic for law enforcement or firefighters, go to themicloop.com, or you can find us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter at The Mic Loop, or on YouTube at The Mic Loop. You guys stay safe.